All right, everybody, thank you for joining me for the Incredible Hulk reaction. All right, I friggin' love the Hulk. As you can tell, sporting my Hulk shirt over here. Letting you know up front, I did see this film once before, 15 years ago in theater. Haven't seen it since, so I'm excited to get back to it and see what I can remember about it. The only thing I remember about it, Abomination is in it. Right, Edward Norton was the original Bruce Banner. Liv Tyler was? Maybe that's why I don't remember her. She got murdered right away. This is their recap to show everything went down. Poof. Let's go. Man, that'll get you hyped, wouldn't it? Days without incident, 158. <laughs> Control your anger, Bruce. Oh my god. Can you imagine living there? Look at that, man. People on top of people. It just seems like everything's built on top of each other. That's crazy. What a view. So he's hiding out here, eh? Can you guys comment down below and let me know why he did not continue to be Bruce Banner throughout the MCU? I don't know a story there as to why. Did he get quit? Did he get fired? What happened? Control me. Oh. oh, wow. What the frick is he doing? Man, it's crazy how some people have like a mastery over their body. Oh, come on. There you go. You're not gonna get angry. That's all we need now is him going off in a factory as the Hulk. Ooh, put him on payroll. Oh, snap. No, no, no. Shut that off! Yeah, turn it off! Ooh, he's gamma contaminated blood. Got in what? A drink? Okay, it didn't actually get into drink. Crazy gluing up a wound. Comment below if you've done it before. I have. Cut my finger nasty. I still got the scar there to prove it. Oh my god. There was two drops? Uh oh. What do you do, man? Look at him. He's got to keep walking. If he comes to her rescue, he could just <laughs> escalate into the Hulk. Oh, he did come back. Oh no. Don't <laughs> worry. <laughs> Don't make me hungry. You wouldn't like me when I'm hungry. And as always, if you want to watch along for the entire length of the film with me, that'll be available on my Patreon page called The Raw Cut. You will need your own copy of The Incredible Hawk to sync up with my timestamp and watch along, but otherwise, it'll be awesome. We haven't seen the last of that guy, I'm sure. Oh. Mr. Blue, Mr. Green. What the frig is this? Making some kind of concoction. He's like a real alchemist here. What's this potion for now? Oh, he's running a test on his own blood. Maybe trying to find a cure? Not gonna happen. Hook cells are the strongest ones there is, right? Come on now. <laughs> what I love about the Hulk is that when you literally, you, like you look up his strength, it says unlimited or infinite. His superpower is the strongest one there is. He'll just get angry and he'll keep getting stronger and stronger until there's no limit, until he breaks the world, right? Because in my DC content, there's people trying to say that Superman is stronger than Hulk. I'm like, okay, well, unless his strength limit is listed as unlimited or infinite, <laughs> then they both can be infinite. It's possible gamma sickness. Milwaukee. Ooh, Stan! Oh, freak. Guess it had a little more kick than he was looking for. No, Stan drank it. Wow. Emil Blonsky, born in Russia. Drank him and bring him back. Blood test shows significant gamma reduction. Mm, it's a reduction, but not a cure. Oh, but I need more data. Why does that sound like they murdered a dog? Oh my god, because they did. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy. Take him. Nope. Target's on the move. Oh, they probably just trank the other dog then. Hello. Where is he? <laughs> Don't mind me. Oh, wow. Obrigado. Whoa, yeah, I guess. Friggin' Bruce, if you escape, you better come back. That look in her eye, right? Know what I'm saying? <laughs> no. Oh my god, that place is like a labyrinth or a maze. No, no. Holy frig. <laughs> that got me. 
Look at him go! Parkour! Parkour! Oh no! Oh! <laughs> you gotta be kidding me! Remembers! <laughs> we went back to work! They're gonna mess him up good if they get him. Oh, give me that! Frank, 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 Frank. 190. Where does he hulk out? At what? 200? It is 200. Oh, oh. Woo! Let's go! You're too late now. Your trains ain't gonna do shit all. Oh, I love how they kept them in the shadows to make him seem like a monster, you know? He kind of is a monster at this point. <laughs> they are keeping him in the shadows. I like it. You can't pierce his skin. <laughs> yeah, live ain't gonna work either. Frag out! Oh no. Woo! Oh, what a cool visual! To see the silhouette of the Hulk there in the explosion. He just wants to be left alone. Whoa, going for the grenade launcher. Oh, there we go. Woo. I don't think he signed up for that. They kind of left out that detail in the briefing, didn't they? By the way, he turns into an indestructible monster the moment he gets angry. That was amazing. Come on now. The way they made him seem like he was literally a monster, right? They kept him in the shadows. They kept, like, the camera angles that they did. It was like, oh, everything about that was great. She helps him, maybe? She is no longer a factor. We closed that door to him a long time ago. He's alone. We had him, and then something hit us. Something big hit us. It threw up. A forklift truck like it was a softball! <laughs> He's got every right to be angry. But if Banner knows what it is, I'm gonna put my foot on his throat and that I'm gonna... That was Banner. Woo! Here we go. He let him know. Look at the look on his face. It's like he did shit his pants. <laughs> he still got the ripped pants and I like it. They're not purple though. Where? Uh, in Guatemala. He traveled quite right away. Claro. Just trying to go home. Where is home for Bruce? I guess America, that's about it. This is a whole new level of weird. So if you're taking another crack at him, I want in. You should be looking for a team that's prepped and ready to fight because if that thing shows up again, you're gonna have a lot of professional tough guys pissing in their pants. <laughs> Better to know what you're going in for, right? He's impervious to all your damage. Well, you know. All right. He was able to beg for enough to get some clothing at least. <laughs> ah, he wants stretchy pants. Biotech force enhancement. Yeah, super soldier. He thought he was working on radiation resistance. I would never have told him what the project really was. Oh, really? They were behind it. Tested it on himself. It was very promising. So why do you run? He's a scientist. He's not one of us. Uh, right. Yeah, if I could take what I know now, put it in the body I had ten years ago, that would be someone I wouldn't want to fight. <laughs> I could probably arrange something like that. Whoa. Right, right, right. He's the abomination, right? So they try to turn him into a hawk, and he ends up being the abomination. 17 days. All right, back on track. Dr. Elizabeth Ross. There she is. Okay, so she is the daughter of the military Ross. And they were in love in a lab, like we've seen in the intro. But it made it look like she died, but she didn't. So he's been keeping his distance as to not put her life in danger. She moved on. Can't blame her, I guess. What do you expect? You almost killed her, and then you go on to run. Oh. I mean, you know how I felt about you two. Have you talked to her? No. She doesn't know that I'm here. What can I do to help you? I could use a bed for a few nights. There's one other thing. Oh, I see. He wants to be able to deliver pizza and get access to the university. I like it. Hey, pal, I'll get a delivery on five. Oh! I don't think anybody up here. Oh, man. It's Lou. As a kid, I used to watch the old Incredible Hulk. 
<laughs> you are the man. I love that little cameo. You, that was such a good show as a kid. Now, granted, all he ever did was roar, throw things around and everything, but who cares? They deleted all records of it or what? Nothing. It's as if it didn't happen. Who's Mr. Blue? Without the data, I can't do nothing for you. He needed that, all that data they had in order to get the cure, and now they wiped it all. It's probably some kind of military record somewhere, though, right? Real quick, everybody, I wanted to mention that if you're ever interested in directly supporting this channel so that I can continue to make videos like this, Patreon is definitely the best way to do so. As a Patreon supporter, you would gain access to many additional benefits, such as early access to the videos before they go on YouTube, movie suggestion and voting rights for Patreon exclusive polls to determine upcoming movie reactions, full-length movie and TV series reactions called Raw Cuts, where you sync up your own copy of the film with my reaction to watch along for the full length of the film. You'll gain access to the full-length trailer reactions rather than the one-minute YouTube Shorts version. As well, you'll be able to check out the behind-the-scenes videos, where I show you what I'm working on, my editing process, and what's going on in my life and with the channel. And much more, and I'm always adding new benefits. Not only would you be helping me to keep my dream of being a YouTube content creator alive, you'd be helping me reach my goal of being able to afford to hire on a video editor so that I can pump out twice the amount of content each week. I'm grateful for your support, and it's the reason that I'm able to continue to make this content. Keep being awesome, people, and let's get back to it. Oh. Oh, no! What a thing to see! Wait here, buddy. She just seen a ghost, right? So that must be like the kind of Italian restaurant that they used to go to all the time when they worked together in that lab. I was wondering how he knew the, the owner. Oh, she's... <laughs> just tell me. I saw what I think I saw. Just tell me the truth. All right, so much for having room and board for tonight, right? Nope, on the run again. <laughs> Poor Bruce. Ooh, did she track him down? Oh, he's trying to get away. Ooh. Does she still care for him? Oh my god. Yep, the feels are still there, everybody. Look how romantic is this. Can't say no to that now, Bruce. Come on. You just don't want to put her in that situation, maybe, or to risk. And now she got to keep a secret from her dad, because you knows what her dad's gonna do. It's our data. Oh, she got it I all. Got in there before they carted it all away. Does the general know that you have this? No. What he wanted to do, he wants it out of me. He wants to dissect it so that he can replicate it. If you're in charge of that part of the department and you know there's a biological weapon out there that can literally destroy anything, be unstoppable. I know he comes across as the villain in this, Ross does, right? But you also can't have it falling in the hands of the enemy, you know, or whatever. You can't stay at all. I want to, but it's just not safe for me to be here. You have everything you need? Yeah. Come on, no. You gotta spend a night together now. Look, there's too much love there. Right? Come on now never seen anybody with so much love in her eyes as her. Look at her. Sleep on the couch or in the spare room. No. Even if they just slept together and cuddled, right? You know as they wants to. Here we go. A very low dose only. And they didn't even turn the lights on in the lab, keeping it all shady. Oh, I'd say. Oh my god. <laughs> the friggin' needles are longer than his neck. Oh, yeah, this one. Putting the needle right in his spine, I can imagine. All in the name of science, right? How come they never continued what? with this love dynamic in future films? Like, we never seen Betty in any of the future films. Why not? Right? Like, she wasn't in Avengers or anything, and... God, now I'm starting to think she's gonna die by the end of this or something. Lord up! Wouldn't your stomach acid destroy the USB stick? Or at least damage it in some way? Ah! General Ross, you're not gonna run Sorry. over your daughter. Dad! Please don't do this. You can't see this clearly. Now get inside. There he is! Do not engage! What do you mean, don't engage? What's their plan? They're just trapping him. Yeah, right. Come on. All you're gonna do is stress him out and he's gonna hulk out in there. Put two canisters in there with him. Trying to gas him. 
I know the Hulk can hold his breath for like an insane amount of time. Bruce, on the other hand, nope. Oh, he's going green. You messed up now, didn't you? I love how the Hulk waits at the last minute. He's like, well, all right, here we go. I got to save Bruce again. <laughs> he's out in the daylight now. <laughs> Too late now. You had to do it before. But there, at this point, they're still testing his invulnerability and his abilities in general, right? Where are the 50 cows? Move your ass out! And they're not gonna... Woo! <laughs> Friggin' Duke's hazard style over there. No, we, uh, think the cows ain't gonna work either. There you go. I love how the Hawk uses things as weapons, improvised weapons all the time. <laughs> what are you just threw it? Oh, we're going viral now, everybody. Oh, the grenade launcher. <laughs> oh, what a scene. Okay, look at him. Freaking ballsy. Yeah, but. Oh, jeez. What do they got there? What kind of cannons are those? Oh, jeez. Okay. Pissing the mob is all it's doing. Bruce is getting angrier. He looks up and he sees Betty over there screaming. That's only gonna piss him off more. There you go. Whoa, he's able to throw it through it. <laughs> they gotta keep taking up the arsenal more and more. They're... None of it's gonna work. You gotta fight super with super, right? Unless you can get some magic involved, but we're not doing that. Is that it? Oh, really? Let's keep pulled back now. Is that all you got? Oh, he's trying to anger him even more. <laughs> is that all you got? <laughs> oh, see, the Hulk is always pulling his punches. They talked about that in the comics before, too. He keeps a little bit of Bruce Banner's mind in there, of his intellect in there, enough to know how to not kill people. They talk about in the comics how, like, he'll shatter the ground and make a building fall in. But he calculates it so that he's not actually going to crush civilians. Ooh, Look out! Oh, now you care about your daughter. If it wasn't for the Hulk, she'd be dead. Or maybe she is dead. Oh, what a visual. You did this, Ross? The same where she dies, is it? Maybe she is dead. Great visuals. I like when they got the, the Hulk in a dark environment because they can work better, right? With the CGI... Oh, she's alive! Ah! Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you're mad at the sky? <laughs> Sounds like a hot thing. Oh, it's okay. stay back, stay back. It's okay. Come on, Betty. Talk him down. Can he transform back? Can he calm down enough? Man, I don't remember anything about this movie. This is awesome. Like I said, all I remembered is that Abomination ends up fighting him on the street at the end. Oh, he's alive. Yeah, he got friggin' stomped into a tree. Oh, wow. She cares for him so much. Like, wholeheartedly. Checking him into a hotel. Oh. Doing damage to his psyche. Oh, hi. Are you okay? I just had to get my data back. You hate it? The circumstances called for a little improvisation. There you go. Purple pants. Let's see it. Right? Look. They were the stretchiest pair they had. <laughs> I'll take my chances. They're all showered up now. Are we going to get a love-making sesh or what? This is such a good romance here. I don't remember why it doesn't carry on into later films. Oh, here we go. Oh my god! 
It's happening, everybody! Bow time! Uh oh. Really? Wait, 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 wait. No! <laughs> what? Never again. Got his heart rate gets up. I can't get too excited. Not even a little excited. <laughs> <laughs> wow. No! No! Now he's got to find some Zen master or something in order to be able to control that. Oh, look at him. <laughs> the doctor's like, what the hell's going on here? I see you back on your feet, soldier. Thank you, sir. Pissed off, I'm ready for round three. <laughs> How are we going to get where we need to go on $40 and no credit card? Well, we could sell this. No, well, that's the only thing you have left from her, no. We'll have to try and get it back. From her mother or something, I guess? Wow, she's willing to sell that. She's all in in that relationship. He's They're tracking it. Be ready. Got into the old shield. About an old truck. Oh, I used to have that camera. She's trying to keep it all positive. I like it. At least he's got somebody now with him, you know? He's not all alone. It's still you inside it. No, it's not. It's like two personalities. It really felt like it knew me. I don't want to control it. Oh, I want to get rid of it. You're going to have to learn to adapt, though. But at this point, he, right, he just wants to be cured of it all and go back to being normal. But even then, he wouldn't be. The military will eventually get him and still run experiments on him. Oh, roadblock. All right. Getting passage where they can. New York, New York. Everything happens in New York in Marvel, right? That's just how it is. Me in a metal tube deep underground with hundreds of people in the most aggressive city in the world. Let's get a cab. Oh, New York cabbies. I've never been in one, but you know, they're notorious. Comment below and let me know what New York cabbies are like. Oh, jeez. I've heard stories, uh, you know, but I've never been to New York. Oh, no. Alright, alright, back off. I have someone who'd like to meet you. Okay. Oh, the guy in blue, he's Mr. Mr. Blue. Mr. Blue, isn't it? Even if everything goes perfectly, get if the dosage exactly right, <laughs> is that going to be a lasting cure? Or just some antidote to suppress that specific flare up? Extraordinary levels of toxicity. So you mean it could kill him? Yeah. Kill him, yeah. <laughs> this will be very dangerous for you. <laughs> yeah. I've always been more curious than cautious. Are we gonna do this? Okay. Oh, he's got his full injection now, does he? I'm trying to remember in the comics, is Abomination stuck in the Abomination form? Or can he shift back and forth? Oh. Yeah. How you feeling, man? I like a monster. <laughs> oh, what a quote. But they intercepted the transmission. They knows he's coming here now to meet with Mr. Blue. Is he wearing purple shorts on that table? Look! This is it. We he wants to cure that bat. He's willing to die for it. <laughs> he's like a mad scientist and he's loving it. Here we go. It's like freaking Frankenstein. Oh my god. Ooh. Oh. Yep, yep. He's not done yet. Oh, the hawk don't want to be cured. Nope. Too late. Waited too long. Oh. There you go. <laughs> Muddy friggin' jump kicks the machine to get it to work. Keep him calm, keep him calm. Is he just shifting back? Cure him. Well, we know it didn't cure him. Maybe at this point in time it did. I can't remember. He did. He's fine. Maybe we've neutralized those cells permanently, or maybe we just suppressed that event. It's hard to know because none of our test subjects ever survived. But of course, they were getting the prime. Did you just test subjects? Oh, jeez, here we go. Bruce, this is all you. You didn't send me much to work with, so I had to concentrate it and make more. Jeez, oh, he's been busy. <laughs> hundreds of cures. We will make humans impervious to disease. The right goal in mind, you know, he's doing it for the betterment of humanity. He's not trying to weaponize it or anything, but still. As soon as somebody finds out there's a lab full of Hulk DNA, that's it. I'm destroy it. Wait, what? Oh. We could get the Nobel for this. You don't understand the power, Mike. But you're being a little paranoid, don't you no, think? No, no. Oh. 
Ooh. Oh, buddy, come on now. Show him to me. Oh, he wants to bring out the Hulk. He captured me. If you took it from me, I'm gonna put you in a hole for the rest of your life. <laughs> like he's like, yeah, I own your body. Friggin' Ross. Oh, don't even talk to him. I will never forgive what you've done to him. There you go. Don't ever speak to me as your daughter again. You're done, buddy? It's only because you're my daughter that you're not in handcuffs. Well, what, she's supposed to say thank you now? Screw you, Ross. Screw you. He was a freak accident. The goal is to do it better. So Banner's the only one. Why are you always hitting people? <laughs> All right. Oh, jeez. Now what? It's not what you've done. It's what you're going to do. Oh, no. I want what you've got to have, Banner. I want that. You look like you've got a little something in you already, don't you? <laughs> oh, he sees into him. Need that. Make me that. The mixture could be an abomination. <laughs> Informed consent. <laughs> all right, all right. Oh my god, I like it too. I could turn you into an abomination. And that he will. <laughs> Let's Oh yeah. You I love that abomination got all the bones. Fix this. <laughs> Knocked him out. What's happening to him? Why is it? What was going on with him now? Why is he starting to? The head brain starting to freak out. Was it dripping blood in there? Some of Bruce's blood into him? Is that what I just seen? You can comment down below and let me know. I don't think that the abomination has the ability to get stronger, right? Like the Hulk does. The hunger can get. The Hulk can get stronger and stronger the angrier he gets, but. I think that's just the Hulk thing. That's what makes him unique, right? I think Abomination is just a set level of strength, which is still nasty high. Why are we going back? Damn it, give me eyes down there! Here we go! You just stand there, man! Move! Yeah! What have you done? One of yours? What have you done? There you go! <laughs> it's the appropriate response. What have you done, Ross? Booyah! Oh, why? you just ate it? <laughs> That's where you shit your pants. Jeez, is this murdering as many people as you can? Ooh. <laughs> like he's freaking kicking up a skateboard or something. Give me a real fight. You've unleashed a monster in New York, sir. It has to be me. You have to take me back there. What are you saying? What other choice do you we have? We made this thing. All of us. Open the back door. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, Bruce. There's the hero inside of him, right? Doing what got to be done. I don't even know if you'll change. Betty, I've got to try. Oh, my God. Beautiful. I love this relationship between the two of them. Why doesn't it continue in the MCU? Or did it and I just forgot about it? What a scene. The Hulk will not let puny Bruce die. Oh! <laughs> oh! There we go. Woo! Look at him. He's pissed and he's ripped. He wants a real fight? Well, now you got one, buddy. Let's go. What a scene for it, too. Just the chaos of, like, a packed downtown city street. Man, they do a great job with some of these, like, visuals that they do like that. And, like, the Hulk coming out of fire and different things that they've done, right? Whew. I'm just there with the abomination standing. <laughs> Please scare boxing gloves. Let's go. Knock him out. Oh, you're just making them angrier. <laughs> Cutting down his own science project now. But to be fair, Hawk was a science project from day one too. It ain't doing anything. You're just gonna kill civilians at this point. There you go! 
Woo! This is sick! I gotta put it down! Better to be on the ground at this point. Woo! Bit of a rough landing. Gonna take a lot more net to take up the abomination. What about everybody on board? Oh, she's alive. Okay. Some of them, not so much. Of course, Ross had to be alive. Thought she wanted nothing to do with him anymore. When you see him dying, it's a little hard to... Ooh. Let's go. Round two. <laughs> the Hulk can fight for days. He's got unlimited cardio. Oh. He can regenerate. It's okay. Come on, Hulk. Dig deep. Yeah, buddy. Woo. Yeah. Oh. Thunderclap. Woo. See what I mean? That's still Bruce's IQ is still in there. The Hulk will let it out when he needs to. Best line of all, Hawk Smash. Get him! Oh! She didn't want him to murder him. There might be no coming back from it. He's out though, he's out. She had to reel him back in to prevent him from ripping his head off. <laughs> I'm sure they heard that across the city. Merciful shitballs. Forgot how epic that was. He's in the public eye now. It's okay. He's a monster on the run. This is such a good movie. We needed more Hulk movies, right? Comment down below, let me know if you agree that we needed more Hulk movies. Oh, he's keeping his distance again? Oh, he's up in BC. What are you doing there? It would be nice if you could get Betty to come back with you. So figure out some way for Betty to be on the run with you. You two are just meant to do that, right? Come on, there's too much love there. Burn pawn shop. Oh, you got it back. Betty Ross. Zero. <laughs> I hate to say I told you so, General, Ooh. but that super soldier program was put on ice for a reason. General. <laughs> Look at him half in the bag. Here you have an unusual problem. You should talk. What if I told you we were putting a team together? The Avengers. Woo! All right, everybody. That was friggin' awesome. I loved everything about it because I didn't remember the plot or direction the story was going to go or the characters that were in it. I did remember that Abomination was in it, but at first I'm like, man, I was forgetting that that guy, that Russian soldier, was the Abomination and everything. What's going on with Betty? Got so many questions and answers, and I can't wait to keep getting into more MCUs. If you enjoyed it, be sure to hit the like button. Watch one of these things. Peace and love, everybody. I'll see you in the next one. All right, take care. Bye-bye.